In this video, we're going to cover how to feature some posts within your pages in your WordPress site. So I have my page here. I got a banner. I got some featured images here, and I want to feature a couple of posts. One of the easiest ways to do that is to just use the query block. So I'll insert after where I'm ready to put in the posts and you just search for uh, query loop block. And then I'm going to choose some of the templates that they have. And right here at the bottom, you'll see this is the, um, this is sort of the list carousel view and the grid view. Um, you can just hit the arrow in the bottom left here. Is that behind my camera? Yeah, I think it is. Okay, in the bottom left, there's just a little arrow there. And then you can kind of go through all of the different template options. And personally, I kind of like the two column layout, this one here, or you can add certain meta to them. So this one here is pretty nice. So uh, it has a column layout where on mobile, it'll have the image stacked over the title. And it also has your meta description here. So let's go ahead and choose that. And you'll see that it's a two column layout within the query loop. It has the post template and then it has the columns and then it has the featured image and the post title and excerpt. So if you need to add these to your thing, um, you can always add and remove them. Like if I want to get rid of the excerpt and then I want to add the um, date above the post title, I'll insert it before and then we'll just search for post date right there. So you kind of get the idea on how to, um, how to feature some of these uh, within the query loop block itself. We're going to go to the block settings and then um, where is the right here? Inherit query from template? No. We uncheck that and then we'll say we want a post type and then we want to filter and then we could choose taxonomies. We could um, use a tag. One of the nicest things about this query loop is that if you make a tag like three post tag that you want to feature and just give all of those posts that specific tag and then you will only feature those three here. Um, I will show you the one that I made for my site. I'm going to remove query loop and then I'm going to use a reusable block um, insert after and then search for that. What was it called? It's list posts here. And then just make sure you unlink it so that um, convert to regular blocks so that it doesn't change anything. Yeah, so I just use the, the, the two column layout, but then I have the title and the date. And then I um, push them to the bottom of that column. So I'll show you what it looks like on my site here. Go to my, here, view this one. So you, you get the idea. That's one way you can feature posts within your page. If you found this helpful, let the algorithm know, and I'll see you next time.